welcome my name is Prue or Prue LaRue and today I'm going to share with you like what I kind of wished my eye look for my NYX face awards video was I've got the products here and I just kind of want to play with them I've done my face everything's listed down below so first off I use the NYX proof it waterproof eyeshadow primer this was actually really nice and tacky and in that video was my first time ever using it. Now, um, I guess we should talk about that, shouldn't we? So the NYX Face Awards is something I've always kind of, uh, like, I've always admired and I've always wanted to, I've always wanted to enter. And I have always wanted to practice and play around a little bit with SFX makeup. Um, it proved a lot harder than I thought it was going to be to do it and like painting my face was a nightmare I thought I could do a rundown of like all the products I bought review like for the for that I used in the SFX because it was way harder way harder than I thought and I'm gonna go on the knit my NYX ultimate edit I'm pulling into this shade down here so I will do this video only mentioning the NYX products just for my own amusement but the NYX Face Awards is something I've always wanted to believe I was good enough to do. Um, and I've always thought, you know when you look at, like it's stupid, but you know when you look at people and they do like those crazy looks, you're like, ah, that's not too hard. Yeah, it's, it's super hard. And that whole process took me about two hours. And I, was man I managed to get it down to like 10 minutes, which is crazy. But my idea for it was, if you're going to watch it, I wanted to do like an anti-plastic swamp queen vibe. Um, and also a little bit Mighty Boosh inspired, which is one of my favorite TV shows of all time. I have my Mighty Boosh earrings on today. So like a little bit, a little bit old Greg. But only I had a lot of fun doing the whole look and concept. I don't know. Um, a lot of people said it looks really good. So that's really nice. I appreciate all your nice. Um, I doubt it's going to get anywhere. But I just, I wanted to challenge myself to try it. And maybe I'll try again next year. Uh, maybe I'll do some looks for Halloween. But I don't know. The whole SFX makeup realm seems very out of my base and out of my realm <laughs> um I know they did say this year that you could enter as just doing a glam look but I'd already by the time they released that I'd already sort of had the things in plan to create the look that I created because like as not good as it was it did take a little bit of planning okay <laughs> um so I'm going to use my NYX Ultimate Palette and I'm just going to pull into this green in the bottom corner and I just want to bring this like a little bit above just for a bit of colour. This palette is not the most pigmented of um, my colourful palettes but it's been fun bringing it out and playing with it again and it can really add like a nice little vibe. So let me know if you watch the NYX Face Awards videos, if you watch, uh, or like what did you think of my look, um, the whole concept. Did it make you, did you get the, uh, I don't know, Salt Queen vibe? So I'm going to lay down the NYX Glitter Primer on my eyelid, just because we're going in with that same foil play from NYX. This is, is this silver it's polished but yeah ultimately I had a lot of fun filming the look and showing my in like showing some people <laughs> what I came up with and I mean all I can hope is that you enjoyed it and that makes it worthwhile for me so it's just got like this little topper on the top. I still haven't figured out the best way to get at it. But just picking that up. And I'm going to tap it across and blend. And it's really nicely pigmented. 
but it is very much a loose shadow which are not I mean they're not something I like playing with regularly but look at that Ooh, I don't know this for women is kind of winning like winning over my heart because I do really like it so just going back with that brush that has that green on it and I'm just gonna sort of blend out the top a bit of this foil I can feel the fallout on me but I can't really see it which is confusing oh there it is I managed to land here and not there when there was some, some powder left Ugh. I guess I'm stuck with it. I don't know how to fix it. I don't think it's super obvious. But I have powder on top of cream, so I have to get my powder blah, my powder foundation, maybe, to cover it up. Yeah, let's bring this sort of light green. And I'm just put that on my inner corner. Yeah, cool. And then... I don't know, I just really like this shade. It's like that camo night, like. Let's do liner, because we can. I've got the next epic liner here. Let's put a little something something on the waterline. Oh yes, mint cream. And let's let's finally bring you in. I'm sorry. Usually I do. Here's where we are at. And this is the NYX Fur White in Mint Cream. These liners are like one of my favorites. Which you would know. Uh, my wings are uneven. I apologize. And then let's check. Yeah, let's do mascara. And we'll pull into Benefit Bad Girl Bang. I've not tried any of NYX mascaras. I could have been. But this one is so lengthening. I thought it was perfect. Just because that silver is so impactful. So here is my final piece of work. The eye look I kind of wish I had done. And it, this is pretty close to what I did do. I just didn't put anything on my inner corner and I didn't put mascara on. That foil is really nice. So, heaps of fallout. Okay. Then for lips, let put, let's put the colour on I wore. And that was the NYX Liquid Suede Stick in Stone Fox. Now this lip actually wore really well and ended up staining my lips. Well, kind of, it just, it took a lot of work to get it off. So it has the staying powder. The staying power, it didn't survive eating very well, but it was pretty good. All right. So I would absolutely love it if you would consider helping support my Dream of the Next Face Awards. <laughs> um, I feel like I know that it wasn't the best look, but I, I really tried. And like, I went outside. I drove an hour from my house to my friend's place so she could help me film uh, and go to the beach and there was lots of people coming past and watching so you know I really put myself out of my comfort zone to do it I would just love it if you had a chance to go on my Instagram at Prue LaRue and tag NYX Cosmetics Australia just get them to see it that would be absolutely amazing um I would really mean the world to me and thank you so much thank you so much for being here I really appreciate you uh anyway Mwah. Mm -hmm.